Hello. <sighs> okay. Nearly a year later, Imagine Dragons have dropped another album. Actually, no, that's a lie. It's been over a year. Before I get into anything, I want to tell you guys that I recently have not been able to edit anything because my program broke and so I have recently fixed it, so I am back. When Imagine Dragons dropped Evolve, that reaction video that I made over a year ago had completely, completely changed the course of my YouTube channel. Now they are back with Origins and I don't know how to feel. So now I am ready to react. I am here. Let's see if I can gather enough energy for this and um, yeah. Like always, I have my trusty iPad, my big one, my baby. Um, we are going to jump into it, I believe. I'm going to be reacting to the deluxe version. There are three songs on here that I have already heard because they were released prior to the album release. So basically the first one is Natural, which obviously I've already heard that. <sighs> Love that so much. But the next song is called Boomerang. So I'm gonna jump into it. I'm so excited for this, guys. Um, yeah, let's just go. It's like really, okay. I'm already- I'm- I'm digging this already. Oh. This is so nice! What the heck? I love the, like, drums already! This is giving me major throwback vibes to Night Visions. I have all the feels right now. Oh my goodness. I can't get over this. The music. Like the actual like music. Wow. I honestly didn't expect Boomerang to be like that. My friend's just like, oh my gosh, yes, it's like my favorite song on the album. And I'm like, okay, I don't know what to expect from this. And it's just, it's so beautiful. It is so beautiful. I mean, I think everybody can like interpret it differently, but I honestly really love that song. I feel like that may be one of my tops on the album already. Like I just, I feel that. So the next song on the album is Machine, which has already been released. And then we got Cool Out. Cool out. Okay. Smoke and mirror vibes? Smoke and mirror vibes. Yeah. Just before I go, I wanna take things slow. I know I'm always facing things slow, but my mind lose control. Wow. We're getting a whole different side of Dan's voice. This is a whole new sound. Wow. I mean, wow. Dan was not lying when he said that this album has a lot of love songs on it um just like evolve and i didn't realize that evolve had love songs on, to, on it until i listened back to the lyrics and i was like oh crap these are love songs so the next song is bad liar which i've already heard because it was released like a week ago and it's one of my favorites ever so yeah west coast is next and i've heard a lot of good things about this song so i'm super excited to hear it like it's the top song on all of my friends list from this album and so I'm really excited to hear what Imagine Dragons are bringing to us with this song. Wow, I just said this song a lot. <gasps> Guitar! Oh, this is so pretty! <gasps> I'm a sucker for acoustic, guys. The 
I'm not crying, you are. <laughs> this is so beautiful. I just, I just need to listen to it. It's, I can't dance or anything. It's just so, it, it's just so beautiful. I am already seeing that this album is so different from what I thought it was going to be. And I am utterly in love. Like, this is a different sound so far. It's more relaxed on these new songs that I haven't heard before. It's more got more relaxed vibe vibes, and I just oh my gosh, oh my gosh. So the last one that was pre-released prior to the album's release was Zero, obviously. But the next one is called Bullet in a Gun. So basically, um, I don't know. I this album has got me completely messed up, so I don't know if this is gonna be a slow song or a fast song. So <laughs> let's just see. Okay. I can vibe, yeah. Okay. It's got a long musical intro. It works though. Okay, it's like in between like a fast and a slow song. It's a bop, that's what it is. I get a lot of vibes. Ooh, I like that. Uh, I like that. This. So this album is confusing me. It's... It's giving me vibes from every album right now, and it's hurting a lot it's like night visions was pain smoke and mirrors was hurt evolve was purity it was beautiful it was love and this was just i want to die i don't even know what i'm saying next is called digital what i'm realizing is that most of the songs on this album have really short names and titles so, yeah, let's go with digital. More guitar, yes, wait and kill it. Oh. I don't know how to, I don't know how to respond to this, I don't. This is just everywhere. Okay, this is... Okay, I like these lyrics. It's not wrong. I love Imagine Dragons. I love everything that they put up. This song is a little questionable to me. Like, if it were to come on... Um... In my playlist, I wouldn't skip it, but it wouldn't be my first choice of a song to put on. Um, I mean, like, I like the talking about, like, how we are, like, the future, but it's not my personal favorite. The next song is called Only. Uh, is this going to be another love song? Probably. I like this. Okay, smoke and mirrors vibe from this. I don't know how, but I am. Okay, 
I like it. I like it a lot. I like the electronicness to it. Dan's voice is on a whole nother level this album. Wow, that was pretty. I really like that. Um, I like how they put like only, they just completely put that into the lyrics and that worked really, really well with them. So I really enjoyed it. So the next song was called Stuck. This slow intro. I'm thriving. This is so beautiful. I could just imagine like Dan like holding the mic, just like seeing with his eyes closed to this song. And just the entire band singing with their eyes closed. Like it's I was singing like playing. The entire band playing with their eyes closed. Like it's so pretty. It's a very it's a very much so a love song, but it's also very Imagine Dragons. And I'm so excited by it. We have four songs left, and me recording this video, I'm already at 25 minutes. That's not very good. So the next song is called Love, and um. And damn. Dan. The love songs. The all Dan's and Ben. I love you guys. <laughs> okay, I'll shut up now. Already with a beat. Okay. It's been a long time coming, coming. Seeming like we all been. Oh wait, this is different than what I thought it would be. Wow. Why can't you just be my brother, brother? We don't have to kill one another. Kill one another. The song. The lyrics. This is such a powerful song. Yeah. You guys need to understand how powerful that song is. Like, oh my goodness, that is... I, I don't know. Like, that is such a powerful song. And I feel like that's gonna touch and reach a lot of people in this world. Like, Imagine Dragons did it again. Also, I got real, like, thunder vibes. Because Dan's like, I probably said thunder, like, thousands of times this year. And I'm like, yeah, well, you're about to say love a million times. So, I mean, that's fine. The next song is called Birds. And the title reminds me of a Coldplay song. Because, like, Coldplay. Birds. I don't know. Anyway. I'm really, like, I'm loving the beats and, like, the beginnings of all these songs. Like, they're so, like, relaxed, I guess. And they're, s I just really, l I love them. Yeah. Oh. Really like these lyrics. This is so pretty. It's my new favorite song on the album. <sighs> the music is killing me. The music, like, um, I just want to go, like, just sway the entire song. It's, that's my favorite, guys. Birds is my favorite. Oh my goodness. Two songs left, Burnout and Real Life. I've heard really good things from both of them, so let's listen to Burnout. I don't really have a prediction for these two songs. I just, 
I'm really excited to hear them and then get my review at the end of this video because boy do I've got a lot to say. Back with like the fade in intro. Does that literally change? Dan is really using his influence in this, his music now, and I'm in love, like, the guys are doing so well. Burnout two second for my favorite song. Oh my gosh. I, I, I have no words. I actually, I, I can only sit here and listen. It's... Wow. I'm just gonna play real life because I have a feeling that it's gonna have an interesting message or a good message. Um, and boy, do I have a lot to say. Like, I, I can't. Wow. Oh my gosh, I'm getting Night Visions vibes. This is not okay. And I'm having a throwback moment. This hurts. Oh my gosh. First line and Dan's already slaying the lyrics. These lyrics. It's a bop. It's it's a bop. It's all bops. Everything's a bop. It's a bop. So, where to begin? Wow. I can see why the album's called Origins because it's this band has been together for ten years, and it, I have felt elements of every album in this one, and I really I can't express like how much effort the guys put into this. Like, you can feel it just listening. The messages and the lyrics, like, the love songs. Like, love has such a large message for everybody, and I think, like, that the band is really using their music to, like, like get a message across to people, and that's amazing. Like, their influence is so... It goes so far, and that... This is really... It's really amazing. Like... Compared to what I thought the album was going to be like, which was something like Smoke and Mirrors or Evolve, we got something completely different. I am thoroughly so incredibly happy with how this album turned out. Um, it reaches my expectations. Like, this was, it's so amazing. And, I mean, it feels kind of rushed because they, in a sense, wrote it in between touring and everything like that. Yet, I really feel like they did a really amazing job for what they were able to do in this short span of time in between touring. Like, guys, come on, like, this album's gold. The band did a live stream from Vegas, uh, well, the night before this album dropped, and um, they thanked a lot of people, and it was really interesting to see them play some of these songs from this album live, and I really actually can't wait for them to tour again, but they do need rest because they tour a lot. I really can't thank this band enough for all that they've done for me and for so many other fans. Like, I've been a fan for 10 years, basically, and to see them come this far, they deserve everything that they've gotten, and I'm so incredibly proud of them. That's it for me today. If you guys enjoyed, please be sure to give this video a thumbs up, comment your thoughts down below on Origins and Imagine Dragons like I want to know, and subscribe to my channel please. I will be uploading more often now that I have a new program, and I'm so excited to share more stuff with you guys. See y'all in the next video. Bye!